Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Um, today I'm going to be doing a little unboxing and review of the Balenciaga runner shoes and the Balenciaga fandom shoes. So I've worn each of these one time and we're going to talk about uh, the comfort and style of both of them in case you are considering um, getting one of these shoes. <laughs> So this is the Phantom. These are in white. They do come in a few other colors, but I got this one. This is the back. Now, these are actually pretty light in comparison to some of the other Balenciaga sneakers. This is from Wear of One Time. And they also put whatever size you are is gonna be on the front of the shoe right there. So I wore these probably for about two hours um, walking uh, in Vegas and they were pretty comfortable. So they have like a little mesh detailing here. They're really soft, they're really lightweight. Um, yeah, so that's that one. This one is the pink runner shoe. A little bit heavier, not as heavy as the Triple S because we know those are super heavy i don't know if you haven't felt one of those um and you see it when you're out at the mall just pick it up you will be amazed at how heavy that shoe is this one is not that heavy but it is heavier than this one um i believe that's because this does have kind of like a chunky heel at the end and yes they do look like asics i'm actually really surprised they didn't do an asic collaboration uh with this one <laughs> but here they are. I just thought they were really cute. Um, they do have your size in the front like the other one. And this one's just, I feel like, a little bit more fun. It kind of has like a bubbly look to the Balenciaga in the back. It's got this if you want to pull your shoe on with it. The little cutouts over here are really cute. However, if you don't wear a sock that's high enough, these will start kind of like cutting into your ankle a little bit and scratching it causing it to kind of be like a little bit uncomfortable. That's the only thing that I felt like was not so comfy with the shoe. But everything else about the shoe, I really did like, and I really, really love this pink color. So they, I know these come in other colors as well, but this is the one I went with. I just love the little gel part. It's got some gel on the bottom. This one I wore one time as well. Now, to begin with, the bottoms, they already come looking like they're like a little bit dirty. So I feel like when you wear them, it's just gonna, you know, get dirtier, but that's the bottom of the shoe, so who cares? <laughs> they also come, both pairs come with one of these dust covers. So it's kind of like a backpack as well. I guess you can just put them both in when you're traveling and just throw them in the bag, which is really nice. So yeah, so that's both of those. They're both, I got both of these in a 37. I feel like they run true to size in this sneaker. Um, I'm a true 37 and these fit perfectly. Like in Chanel sneakers, for instance, I have to size up like a full size. So for these, I didn't, they were both great. That's the pink and that's the white one. So yeah, if you're looking for like just a comfortable designer shoe that's kind of like subtle, this is definitely like a really good one. And like I said, they do come in a few other colors, so. One for comfort, one for fun. If you have any questions about these shoes, um, just comment below. This pair right here, I believe is on sale right now um, at Forward. And I think, I'm not sure, I think they're like 25% off or something. So when I got these, I think they were like about five something. So it was a really good price for those. I believe these are on sale now too, but I'm not sure of the price. Um, but if you have any questions, just uh, post it and I will get back to you. Okay, guys. Thanks.